Hey friends, Joe here at Reverb. Today I get to show you the new lower pedal from Walrus Audio. This thing is amazing. They're calling it a soundscape generator. It has vast ambience. It has reverse reverbs, reverse delays. It's super cool um, and kind of immediately uh, intuitive. The thing with this pedal is it has two DSP chips running in series and they each have their own analog feedback path. So where kind of the heart and the magic of this thing is is there's five different programs via this program knob and you can control how the DSPs interact with each other. Plugging a guitar into this thing, immediately I'm having all kinds of ideas. It's very intuitive and, and there's just tons of ideas just waiting there. But I'm also hearing like a Wurlitzer electric piano being very cool through this. So I wanna try guitar stuff and then I wanna do some Whirly stuff. Also, we're gonna be running everything through the Walrus Audio Canvas DI, which is an amazing thing. Uh, if you haven't heard about this, check it out. There's a mono and a stereo DI and isolator from Walrus. The Canvas, for the guitar, we're gonna be going through the DI and an amp. And then for the other instruments, we'll just be going straight through the DI. Okay, the first program uh, combines reverse delay with reverse reverb. And again, these, these separate feedback paths is where a lot of this magic happens. It kind of like organically creates these different interactions of the feedback paths. Let's check it out. Something that I discovered sounds really cool with this program is regen knob all the way down, feedback knob up, and then creating kind of chaos with slides among your riffs. Okay, program two is a reverse delay into an octave up reverb. So on this setting, you have a regen knob that, that adds a shimmer to the reverb, and then a, uh, your X knob kind of controls the decay of the reverb. Cool trick on this program also is turning the mix knob all the way up and using volume control so you, you're just catching these, these more um, defined delays and then you have that shimmer back there too. Bye. 
So as program two had the lighter reverb with the higher octave harmonic feedback function, program three goes the opposite direction. It's this low octave feedback, uh, thick, murky reverb, super cool. So that regen knob still controls the octave, it's just the low octave on this program. X knob still controlling the decay of the reverb. Okay, program four is reverse reverb into forward reverb. So this dual reverb engine going on here is perfect for like just super lush ambient pads, especially with the mix knob all the way up. You can basically just move through chords and you're creating constant cloud bedding, which is amazing. Okay, program five is pitch delay into pitch delay. So we have these dueling pitch delays, the feedback and regen knobs control on the amount of pitch delay repeats. The X knob, you can control like the direction that it goes. You can also get um, a different order of fourths, fifths, and octaves. <laughs>
Okay, friends, there you have it from Walrus Audio, the lore, soundscape generator, ambient pad creator, reversed reverb, double DSP chip interactive thing. It's awesome. You should definitely check this out. Beyond just creating awesome music with, um, I do a lot of work in film and I could, I could definitely hear this being used for a really cool sound design effect thing for films. Can't wait to use it in that capacity. Definitely check this thing out. The lore from Walrus Audio, always good stuff. Joe from Reverb, out. Thanks so much for watching.